Midnight Excursion from the Zen Flesh Zen Bones, the 94th story, written by Paul Ritz. Many pupils were studying meditation under the Zen master Senkai. Studying and seeking are two different things. Please try it out. When you study, you follow your master. When you study, you follow your religion. When you study, you follow your parents. That is where the struggle, the problem starts. You should seek. When you seek, you will seek your wife your husband, your children, your property, your Sanskrit, your culture. When you seek, you become the master. When you study, you become the slave. Think over it. One of them used to rise at night, climb over the temple wall and go to the town on a pleasure jaunt. Pleasure is your purchased. When you study, you go on a pleasure jaunt. You don't know why you're going. You are a you have been hypnotized, you call it mass hypnotism. Everybody is going, say, I also go. Then everything spills out of your pocket. Like in Rakum school, we used to say, do not spill anything outside your plate. If you spill anything outside your plate, please put it back into your place. Because tomorrow money will spill out of your pocket and that is the, that is the poverty of the land. And then Raghun Guruji continues to say, Training members are coming to polish the floor, not to take your waste. And if we allow them to see your waste, they will understand your weakness and they will destroy you. You have allowed the mass hypnotism to destroy you. They are not destroying. You are a fly. You get attracted to the Candle light and you fall into the light again and again to get burnt alive and you're getting burnt alive. Hence Swami Vivendra said, people are walking like dead bodies. One of them used to rise at night, climb over the temple wall and go to town on a pleasure journey. You don't have to climb the temple wall. When you're seeking, the door is always kept open. There is no doors first of all. You're climbing the wall. You are allowing another person to blackmail you, backstab you, making another person to make you a, a slave. So please try to understand all students, seeking and studying are two different things. You must seek, once you seek, you become, you don't see things, you observe things. Seeing and observing are two different things. Without every child understand that one, you don't need any medicine, you don't have to learn by heart. The mind just grasps, grasp it, yes. The sound of the one and clap, they call it. The moment the teacher opens the mouth, the sound itself penetrates in every cell of your brain and it strikes without thinking, answer flows without thinking. Pleasure jaunt, climbing the wall. It's a pickpocket, it's a robbery. When the doors are there, you should walk outside. You can walk easily, or nobody will stop you. Senke inspecting the dormitory quarters found these people missing one night and also discovered the high stool he had used to scale the wall, copying in the examination. It's not your own words which came from your heart, from your understanding, from your observation. You have written things by heart like any other slave. You have worked as if you are a robot machine, but you are not purchased. The factory, you make fun of the typist telling the typist keep typing, but he never became the judge, the judge, judge keeps on dictating. But this man never thought of becoming the judge. If you have understood what the what the dictation is there, you could have been much powerful than the judge. You go to the factories. The same thing, you are in a hurry to marry, you marry, but you have not observed your wife, you were seeing your wife. You are in a hurry to marry, you have not observed your husband, you have only seen your husband. When you see, you become the slave and slavery is very close to sickness and the one sickness leads to 10,000 varieties of sickness. Like yesterday somebody asked me, cardiac arrest, does it happen immediately? Was there any cause of it? Do you think cardiac is just like a devil, just an invasion, invading army? Army won't invade if your body is so very strong. If you have a muscle in your body, which army can enter your country? So you don't have to then army invaded just out of the blue. No, no, no army, no robber invades. If you have done your homework, cardiac arrest happened. They asked me, 
Does it happen immediately? I said, no. Tell me, Guruji. Oh, please, Rakum Guruji, please tell me. I said, no. It must have started his work 45 years back if it is old time and the present generation, 15 years. From where it starts? I said, from the cold. The first cold is the first shot given by the nature, by the body, telling there's a problem in the society, problem in your house, problem in your body. And you go to the doctor because you climb the wall. Yes. Using a stool, not outside the gate. You can walk outside the gate. You don't have to hide and seek because you are healthy. When you are not healthy, when you do not create your own muscle power, you have to climb the wall. You have to be a pickpocket. From the cold, you suppress the cold. The cold will give you the suppression of the medicine, give you another disease called the cough. When you suppress it with cough, with medicines, the cough will turn out to be an asthma. Asthma, you suppress it, becomes TB, TB suppress, it becomes cancer. And you die, you go down. And by the time you give the money to the doctor, the doctor has constructed a three floor, five floor. And people still doesn't understand that. They call it genetic, genetic. No, no, no. People are now, they are prudent. It's not diabetes, is not genetic. Heart disease is not genetic. Just changes in your lifestyle of your food habits. You are eating without chewing. You are gulping it out without chewing. You are hurry but eat, eat fast foods and then you are not slowly eating. You are not eating fruits before your meals. You eat fruits after your meals. That is a problem. You try to drink food, cold water along with your meals. Zero oil cooking was not there. You are not cooking in slow fire. To eat, no work, no food. You will not eat without the work, without the sweat. All this is a culmination of your first cold, which leads you to cancer, cardiac arrest and die. Now try to understand that one. Sanka inspecting dormitory quarters found these people missing one night and also could discover high stool he had used to scale the wall. Sanka removed the stool and stood there in its place. Yes. You don't have to have another book to copy. You don't have to have another person to give you a job. Why did you use another stool to climb the wall? When the gates are there, you could have walked outside the gate. When you melted with your teacher, you melted with your wife, with your children. Where is not freedom? Freedom is you create fear because you are not melting with the people. You are not observing the your own people, observing your own body. You When you observe your own body, you know your body needs muscle. That is the first security. You have to work out. You have to make sure that every part of the body moves. No sweat. No food. No work. No food. 